Hi students! So I'm going to make a sketch for you of uh, basic shapes and uh, to do that I have a very helpful model here, my daughter Abigail. She's going to model for me today while I do this drawing. And so here she is, she's sitting in the chair, she looks pretty cute. <laughs> and here I have my blank sheet of paper and you'll notice that there's one thing I don't have and that is an eraser. Just me and my pencil. All right, so I'm not gonna be erasing anything. I'm just gonna be sketching as quick as I can. Okay, so I will always be looking up at Abigail and looking back down and looking back up at Abigail over and over again to get the sense of these different shapes. Good, sitting still for me so that I can get kind of sense. Look up. And then, you know, if if I feel I just make judgments. So here, you know, I'm looking at <clears throat> how far around her skirt goes before her knee starts, and then how far on this side before the knee starts. And I'm trying to, to make a guess. I think it's a little more like that. And I think this shape is wrong. I've done kind of a flat shape. I was just thinking about what a skirt looks like. Instead, I need to <clears throat> really look at what the skirt looks like. And there's a bunch of these sort of lines that help too. And then I want to get the way there's kind of a curve uh, where she's got some muscle on it. Like and then she's got a little cute ankles. <laughs> and then feet. Come on over there. <laughs> and then I want to get the other foot. So I'm just, I'm trying to draw the shapes as I see them and then adjust them if they're wrong. And you just, you're continually doing this, refining what you've drawn and then looking for pose. She's got her hands to her mouth. I don't know why, but I'm going to draw it because that's what she's doing. And she's got And she's got hair that comes across like this. And I think I've drawn her face too small a little bit. And so it's made it look weird. And I'm 
we're starting to get. more of a look of the face and here's some line of her fingers this is always a tricky part hands <laughs> and then as I go I'm I'm looking at at what I've drawn and I'm looking for where I think it's correct and I'm adjusting where I think it's incorrect and in that in that way I I'm going back over and I'm darkening some of the lines and so you now you can start to see the shapes becoming more clear and it starts to look more realistic and so